thank you all for that beautiful, delicious pocket. I invite you to take a few more moments to really take it all in at your own pace. And breathe it in, breathe it out. I think my favorite moment is that moment of silence when everyone comes together and collectively decides to create silence. There's something magical about that space. And for me, I feel this intense clarity on so many levels when everybody is just silent. I just wanted to share that because I was feeling that for a few moments. Appreciate everybody showing up tonight and rolling with the uh, with this hot weather. It felt really, really good to me, and I was really felt like I was embracing it. I was challenging it to become even hotter. <laughs> starts dancing. I just love it. I just love giving as much energy as I can to the room, but especially the women when they start dancing. That's right, Andrea, that you. Talking about you. Of course, my wife and of course everybody else here, you guys were phenomenal. And I'd love to do this again and again. I hope you guys continue to spread love in your own way. This is how I know how to spread the love for me and you. And I'm excited that my brother showed up tonight. I don't know if he's still here, but... <laughs> and everybody that showed up for the first time, I'm really a sincere thank you from the bottom of my heart. This really warms me. And, you know, we've decided to try and take this outside of the living room and bring it into Nyack and and let other people experience it. And because I think more people need to, to hear about it, what Alan's doing up in Chestnut Ridge. Um, it's just really positive stuff. And the world needs a lot more of the positive stuff. So I'm gonna continue to do it. I appreciate all of you doing it with me. Bless you. And you guys are just awesome. This is just phenomenal. This is an epic night. It, it took a lot of twists and turns. Mm -hmm. The adventure of getting here from the outside, it was just, it, it was intense for about 30 seconds for me because I had set everything up. I wanted everything to be perfect outside. And the truth is, it was perfect inside. So, I mean, there's a lesson in there too, you know. Everything that you plan to do just does not end up happening at all the way you planned it in your head, but you were so prepared. It didn't matter. It didn't matter. Just turn the computer on and we start playing. Somebody starts laying glue down and then people start jumping on that wave and then it ping pongs and everybody just is is feeling secure and confident and safe and is able to just express <coughs> themselves. And that's what I really get off on. I just love it so much. And so Thank you again, and uh, Elena cooked up a delicious ziti, and uh, I, I welcome everybody to uh, to stay and, and nosh and have a drink or two or three, and we're just going to chill out. And who we knows? Don't have the kids here, so. We don't have the kids here, so we, we don't know what to do with ourselves. Actually, we do. We know exactly what to do with ourselves, but we're going to do it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, yeah. Thank you guys so much. Yeah. As always, you know, we should all we should all get a drink in our hands, and if anybody has anything they want to share, we, you know, please like feel free to just speak your mind. And if you want to say something, you don't have to, but just all here. Thank you. Amen, brother. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Just tell us where and when. <laughs> oh, you'll be the first to know. You'll be the first to know.
and I will have a, a recording of that for everybody. I have something I want to say. It's, it's not about this. It's the it story is about this. As we were, as we were doing this process and winding it down, it brought me to a place of reflection on my life and how I came to be in this room. Because it's improbable. Well, let's say not improbable. Let's say it happened due to certain circumstances. So what I'm getting at is this. Um, I'm writing a book.